What is up and welcome to Insurance Agent Training every Monday, 2 o'clock Central Standard Time. Today, I got something good, man. Not only are we going to talk about trial closing, one of my favorite things when it comes to sales. But if you didn't get one of these last year, I'm going to make sure you get one of these this year at Apris Nation Insurance Wealth Conference. This was from 2018. These things are soft. I love wearing these. I love working out in these things all the time. And we're going to have plenty of these to go around in Dallas at Apris Nation 2019 coming up literally in a couple of months. It's nuts, right? A couple of months and a half. So trial closes. What are my three favorite trial closes? Do you understand what trial closing is? Do you currently use trial closes in your business? And when you do, what are the results? Are you stopping when you ask a question so that you can actually finish with a trial close and actually get an answer? Or are you talking past the trial close? So today, I wanna to share with you the three, there's a lot of them. Like when I do benefits presentations, I go through like eight trial closes. So we got tons of videos on that. It's in our university. Today I wanna to talk about my three favorite trial closes and why. The first one, I love this one, right? Because it gets some engagement, it gets some feedback. It tells me the person that they wanna help, which is hey, who do you want your beneficiary to be? It's all about training insurance agents. And when you know their beneficiary or know what they want to protect or know what's important to them, like it don't have to be that, right? If you're selling auto and home, right? What are we looking to protect, right? This car, why this car? Why was this car important, right? Exactly. Or Medicare, right? What are some, some, are some health concerns? What are some big things you want to make sure that are covered? It's, it's, it's literally... Something a trial closing is something to pull them in your general direction. You're over here, they're over here, and you can trial close to get some little yeses and some little answers along the way to get them closer to you. Also, one of my favorite ones, I go from the warm-up to the fact find. I use it a few times too, and you can ask it in different ways. I'll use I'll use the same question multiple times in an appointment if I ask it in a different way. So hey, Betty, what got you thinking about this? What got you thinking about all this, right? Okay, well, I'm getting old. Well, what was it about getting old, right? That's not an answer. What was it about getting old that got you really contemplating the need for all this? It's a different, or, well, I just, you know, I, I know that I'm going to need something to take care of my final expenses, you know? Well, what was it about the importance of final expenses that really started to get you thinking and concern you because I want to make sure that I'm helping you with all of that, right? So what was it? I just ask that same question three different ways, but in essence, it was the exact same question. So a lot of people don't, you don't realize that you can do that, but you can ask the exact same question three different ways as long as you change up the question. I learned a long time ago, I can ask the same question over and over and over again as long as I change up the way that I'm asking it. So when that question comes up, right? Can I continue to ask it in various ways to get different answers? That's the cool thing about changing up the question. When you're trial closing, it's the purpose of it is to get them to move, get an answer, gain information, get a yes, right? All those things, trial closing is meant to get you closer to the close, the big monster daddy close, right? Just like Monster Premier, which is a seating section of 8%. The third one, which benefit is your favorite? Sue, of these five benefits, which one is the most important to you? Which one is your favorite? Which one did you like the most? Like you just heard me ask the same question three different ways. Ask it however you want. But when I go over, right, when I go over five benefits, I'm asking, can we go over these? Is it okay if I share with you these? Then I've got the one, two, three, four, five. Then on the fifth one, I've got two, right? So I got another one. Then I'm asking which one's your favorite. So there's another one. There's literally eight trial closes in my one benefit presentation. And that's the only reason for the benefits presentation is why? It's because it's focused on value, increasing the value in their eyes, right? And the fact that I get to ask eight trial closes along the way doesn't hurt, right? So at the end of the day, what are you doing that 
can get you closer to the cell. You've got to have things in your head, specific things that you're used to doing, saying that you like to do every single time, right? I got this question last last Friday on Apricent Club. Somebody said, hey, Cody, what are some of the things that you want to make sure that you always ask? What are your three favorite questions or, or what's the questions you like to ask a lot? And that kind of got me thinking about this topic. Dylan's like, hey, dude, I think that would be a really good show on Monday. We should consider doing that. So here we are doing it, right? Think about the things that get you closer to a cell. What are the things that you like to do? What are the things you, you don't like to do? What are the things that work well? When like I used to record my appointments because I would say, okay, I would listen to it. Okay, th this question went really well. They liked that question and it got me closer to the close. Oh no, that was a really dumb question. Don't do that ever again. Or you know what, that question's really amazing and it gets them engaged in thinking. So start like you have to be a master of your craft Trial closing just makes you a better master at closing because you're getting them closer to the close, right? So I'm going to keep today really, really short. At the end of the day, it's all about try. I want to get on. The reason we do these shows is I want to get on, dump information, value, something for you to learn and put up here that you can remember because at the end of the day, it's insurance agent training. I'm going to put on my professor hat and I'm going to go to freaking work and train and focus on helping you guys every single Monday, which is why <coughs> this is one of my favorite shows, right? Because it's focused on actual training. You learn something every day that you didn't learn in college. You learn something every single day you didn't learn in school. You learn something every single day that you haven't heard in probably an audio book, a book or a, another insurance course or another mentor, right? Because we try to come up with original content that helps you succeed and that helps you get in front of more people. That's why we're adding additional brands and companies because at the end of the day, what I'm here to do is help you succeed. So no matter how I can help you succeed, I want to be there with you. We got, we just got back from literally the, this, the, 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 the weekend prior to this past one, the retreat, right? And it was a blast. It was a ton of fun. It was awesome. It sold out 45 days in advance. And I'm telling you, we unleashed some sick, amazing content at that retreat. We peeled back the curtain on some stuff that we've never shared before or talked about before. The back end of our YouTube, right? All of our SEO, our websites, our blogging, our lead gen, all advertising, all this kind of stuff, right? That people don't know how to do. SEO, Google AdWords, all the stuff that we do that works that most people in our industry do not do. Again, I love hanging out with you. Thanks for watching Insurance Agent Training every Monday, 2 o'clock Central Standard Time. I appreciate you guys. Trial closing. I want you to be a closing master. Master the art of closing and getting people to make decisions and move. And guess what? You will be a master sales person, master negotiator, master closer, all of the above. At the end of the day, if that's your goal to drive revenue, then trial closing gets you closer to driving revenue. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you being here with me. I love hanging out with you. Hope you have an incredible rest of your week. Let's go strong this week. Let's go all out. Let's get in front of some people and let's make some money and let's hang out at 8% 2019 in Dallas. Appreciate you guys. Have an awesome week. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Phone Phenom, 5 o'clock.